Mayor, just one more, just off topic sure. on this one, if I could. Um, obviously, as you know, right now, the, the homeless encampment in McPherson Square is being cleared. Um, that clearing was bumped up about two months. There was multiple council members and organizations that asked for it to be delayed because they said some people down there still weren't connected to housing and won't have anywhere to go today. Um, I'm just curious uh, why you decided to proceed with the clearing as it as it, it's happened. Um, we don't believe um, that it is safe for people to live on the street. Uh, and, and we especially don't think it's safe for people to live in a growing and even an increasingly dangerous encampment. Um, and people who care about housing and getting people housed, in my view, shouldn't want that either. Uh, and so the argument was that we should wait until April. Uh, and in April, we think that there could be untold numbers of people um, who were living there in unsanitary and dangerous conditions. Uh, as you know, uh, we have been working over a couple of years on making sure that people who are living in encampments are connected to the resources they need, housing or shelter. Um, and it is probably also very clear to you uh, that people who find themselves in a homeless encampment oftentimes have many, many hurdles to get over um, that make connecting to services difficult. So no one should um, promote the idea that we're not trying to connect people to services or the abundance of housing assistance that exists in DC. Um, but we should all be clear that this is one of the most complex human uh, uh, conditions and problems that exists in a city. Uh, and making sure that people who are in desperate need of help get desperately helped um, is what we're focused on. Um, but we know because we've had experience with other sites that when we can get people in a more stable environment, they are more likely to be able to use the vouchers that they already have. They are more likely to be able to get um, their behavioral health issues stabilized. They're more likely to be able to connect um, to their doctors. And for sure, they are less likely to be preyed on by people who are turning those encampments into drug dealing havens. So I gotta be clear. Um, we got to do better than McPherson, um, and, a, and a way to do that uh, is making sure that people um, get the services that they need. Now, is it a, a, a magic wand? No, it's not. Will there be people that we still have to, that will move to other places because they just don't want to come inside? Yes, there will be. Um, but what we have seen from in site to site is that there are fewer people each time and more people are getting connected to services. Um, so that's why we didn't wait for this kind of artificial date in April um, when the hyperthermia season is, is over. You've seen the temperatures in February um, and we're not talking about this notion that people are being ev evicted from outside squalid conditions is I think the wrong language to use. Um, what we're doing is insisting uh, that people get connected to the services that we know work.